Yeah, yeah. 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 Listen, you're a, you're a former lawyer. You have any speaking of Trump right fast. Do you know uh, the Supreme Court, all uh, what's going on, Kevin out and all that? Do you have anything? No, I refuse to read about it. And it's, it, it, it's going to be a tragedy if he does or doesn't make it because they'll just and put another one in just as stupid and just as vile. So what do you vicious. know? What do you know? You don't read it, but what? No, I know about it, and I know what's going to happen. I mean, the whole the, the Republicans and conservatives have got themselves about three generations worth of shit they're going to pile on anybody with a clean thought in their head. Any kind of a liberal, any kind of a Democrat, any kind of a person that wants inclusion in government is going to take three generations to clean up the mess that the Republicans under Trump have caused. Trump and the Bushes, too. You think he's going to go in? I Kevin don't know. I, there's no reason why he wouldn't, you know, unless they can hold it off until the Democrats take over. But I don't care. It's the Americans' problem. It's theirs. Theirs are the women that are going to die from bad abortions down there. That's their problem. 60, 70 percent of them approve of abortions, you know, and that's going against the will of the, of, of the nation. And that country just turned itself upside down. They're idiots, and they deserve all of that shit. How come the streets talking more about Kavanaugh? I can't even say I can't pronounce the H at the end, Kevin out, then uh, Michael Bryan or uh, the election that's right across the because street. Because it's going to affect our, any of their politics affects us. And any Court? of their policies affects us. And we're going to be a rogue nation relative to the U.S. once Kavanaugh takes over and they change every abortion position and every Medicare position and all that shit. We're going to look like a bastion of rightfulness. And, and hopefully a, a population explosion of Americans running away from the mess that's going to be created. Do you think we're going to escape the America, Donald Trump? He doesn't seem to I like Canada. I'm not going to go near that country until he's in jail and they have a woman president. And that's it. And I will not even, I got sisters down there hostage to them. They love Bushes and they love Trump. And they're the most hypocritical religious people I've ever had in my family and my life. And there they are, touting the Bible and the Falwell Baptist and all the rest of it. And they're back on that shitty asshole. Why would they that's support Trump? Why would they, they support Trump? Why wouldn't Why they? would a person support Trump? Because they're going to appoint Kavanaugh, who's going to get do all the goodies that the good Baptists want. And that's purely it. They're trading in their souls for a Supreme Court judge who will ban abortions, who will make the Christian religion the law of the land, and we're going to have people just hanging around for another thousand years or so like this with spikes through their hands. What That's about, what, 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 but isn't that better having uh, something like that than having marijuana legalized? <laughs> Everybody had a toke. We'd be the, the, the greatest nation in the world. We'd be procreating and eating. We'd be overweight from, uh, and, and just screwing like crazy. But our, our uh, health care system wouldn't be, be able to afford it. We have one of the best health care systems We won't be able to afford world. it. Everybody's obese. So? The government prints money. We don't have to worry about who can afford what. You know, everything is great. People send them me money every month. I, I don't know who they are. I thank them silently, you know, when a check goes in the bank. And it's awful nice. And if I go past those gaming machines and that, I say, plug them in, pal. You're paying my money. I consider it salary for not screwing things up in government. I get paid for staying home. Kevin not going to go in? Oh, I don't know. No, they he's going to go in. They have to do it. They'll, they'll do it. And that's going to cause not? a not war, a not war with the female, uh, oh, yeah. the abuse, violence, yeah. and all that that's on the what streets. We thought what happened before? But Trump still get in. I don't give a shit. We're safe here. <laughs> Eleven Charles Avenue over there, the most peaceful, quiet, stress-free acre in the world. And that's twice you mentioned. Acre. That's twice in these videos you mentioned your uh, home address. Are you lonely or something? Not at all. I, I I can't be lonely. I got my dog and my mom and my wife. What else? You know, really. <laughs>